Hi, I'm Alex Oss. I'm an attacker on Team USA, and I'm here to talk about faking, reading a goalie, and finishing. So the first thing you need to remember when faking and finishing around the crease is it's not a fastest shot competition. So you don't need to make these big fakes and really rip the net. This is all about finesse and kind of moving your goalie and finishing. The second thing is I like to say, call our fakes hitches. So you want to be able to shoot out of your hitch. So if you make an awesome big fake and you fake your goalie, if you reset and bring it back to your triple threat position, they're going to be able to reset. So little hitches and being able to fake and shoot out of it. And then the third thing is just really reading your goalie and seeing the back of the net. So if you have a goalie that's playing super high or a goalie that's super active or a goalie that's holding, those are all going to be different things you need to know and just read and assess the situation and then find the back of the net. Definitely around the crease, I like to kind of fake low and then shoot high. The top of the cage is really open and it gives a lot of room for error, so I really like to, you know, use your whole body and kind of get the goalie going low so they drop down to the ground and then you have the whole top of the cage to finish on. So I choke up on the bottom of my stick a lot. Um, I think that you have to protect your stick as a crease attacker and kind of keep it in front of you. So keep choking up on your bottom hand, keeping your stick in front of you, and those little hitches with your arms extended so you don't have to bring the stick back. So if your arms are extended in front of you, you can really pull with that bottom hand and still get the speed on your shot. Hi, I'm Alice Mercer. I'm a defender on Team USA and today I'm going to talk about knockdowns and interceptions and starting the fast break from there. People who, you know, don't necessarily look like the stereotypical athlete can, you know, be amazing. 